Meanwhile, McDonald's earnings are just out, and we want to get straight over to Kate Rogers, who has those numbers. Kate, good morning. Hey, Andrew, good morning to you. A strong first quarter for McDonald's with beats on the top and bottom lines. EPS coming in at $1.92 adjusted. That is an 11 cent beat. Revenues $5.12 billion. That's higher than the $5.03 billion that was projected. In the U.S., same store sales increasing 13.6%. As business lapped the lows of 2020, that was much higher than the 10.2% gain expected. The company said it saw benefits from average check growth and double digit positive comps across all. All day parts. That's thanks in part to national menu and marketing additions, things like limited time offering of spicy chicken nuggets and the addition of three crispy chicken sandwiches to its lineup. Digital and delivery also boosted sales in the quarter. Same store sales increasing 7.5% overall. That's also higher than the 4.9% expected. International operated markets, same store sales increasing 0.6% and 6.4% in international developmental license markets and corporate locations. COVID-19 restrictions are still impacting some international markets, but China, Japan, UK, Australia, and Canada all saw strong business during the quarter. In a statement, the company's CEO, Chris Kemchinski, said, we are maximizing marketing in a culturally relevant way, committed to the great tasting customer favorites on our core menu and doubling down on digital delivery and drive through like so many other companies to create a faster and easier customer experience. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.